This is Frank with The Brain Garage and the introduction to our course on how to make brainwave and hypnosis MP3s. If you've been watching and listening to our YouTube channel, you know there are roughly four different kinds of programs you can create that have brainwave music embedded in the soundtrack. We're going to teach you in this course how to make all four of them. And all you need, really, are two pieces of open source software and to listen and watch these videos. It's really pretty simple, and after five years of producing these kinds of programs, we've learned some shortcuts and are able to chunk it down in order for you to, I guess, uh, skip over the learning curve that we've gone through and just get started creating your own programs. Now, because we have these different categories on our channel, we do know that people will listen to the ones they want to listen to. So we are going to go over all four categories, but you may find yourself not interested in one or two of them, and that's okay. The technology is the same, and just by watching the videos, you're going to learn the whole scope of what you can do with this kind of technology, and it is really kind of interesting. Now, for people who are not familiar with this technology or the experience of listening to these kinds of MP3s, there are basically four different kinds of effects you can create using this technology. First, you have sleep. You can create background music that helps you go to sleep in a very natural way. Second, you have deep meditation and personal change, which you can also use the background technology to create for yourself. By listening to these kinds of MP3s, you go into a very deep state of relaxation, almost sleep, and people, quite frankly, often do go to sleep using this second category. The third category is light relaxation or daydreaming and is often used for creativity. We like this because you don't go to sleep using these kinds of mp3s, but you do access more of your creative mind and are able to make, I would say, nonlinear connections between ideas. Lastly, we have the category of brainwave MP3 where you can really make sure or make certain that your mind is in a high state of focus and concentration. We have found that these programs have been very popular on our YouTube channel. And for those of you who are listening or watching, you can make your own MP3 using the material in this course and the open source software. So if you have some music that you would rather listen to than the ones we provide, or I should say than the soundtracks that we provide, you can simply use the ideas here to create your own programs, and we encourage you to do it. We're very grateful that we've uh, accumulated about a 1,000 subscribers in just a few months, so really this course is our way of saying thank you and propagating the information so that people can either learn about it and understand what it is they're listening to, or really to make your own programs. So I hope you enjoy this course. Please watch all the videos and make sure to download the software that I'm going to link to in the description underneath this video. Just for your information, the two pieces of software are Gnoral or Noral, I'm not quite sure how to pronounce it, and Audacity, the open source, open source editing software. Now, if I was really persnickety, I would use Audacity to edit out that last mispronunciation, but 
I have found that the audience is pretty forgiving and that you don't mind if we just leave the raw audio in the way it is. So that's it for this introduction. Go to the next video where I'm going to talk about in more detail the different kinds of brainwave music you can create using the open source software programs.